Dear parents, students and staff of Colossi Ciaran, I hope that you're all safe and well at this challenging time. As you know, last week, the government took the decision to close schools and to move teaching and learning online until the end of January, where a review of this decision will take place. We know that this is a worrying time for everyone, as we now have to juggle work, family and school from our own homes. However, we can take confidence from the fact that we've done this before and that there is a plan in place to help us improve on our experiences from the last school closure. We want you all to know that we understand the stresses and worries that this school closure can bring and to assure you of our continued support to you all as we manage these challenges. The purpose of this video is to outline what supports our school has put in place to support each other through this school closure. It's important to remember that while the school building may be closed, our team is here to help you in whatever way we can in navigating these difficult times. To help you to understand what is required of us all during this school closure, we have compiled a guidance document which clearly outlines the approach we will take to online teaching and learning. We know that each home and context is different, and so the purpose of this document is to provide guidelines which are clear, manageable and easy to follow. I encourage you to read this document carefully and then apply the guidance to your own context. Throughout this school closure, our teachers will put together a programme of blended teaching and learning, which will comprise of online lessons, individual learning activities, as well as scheduled assignments. These lessons will follow the normal school timetable and will be put up on both Google Classroom and your class progression sheets. We encourage students and parents to check both Google Classroom and the progression sheet regularly in order to keep track of the assignments and deadlines which apply to your classes. During this time, our care team of year heads, chaplain, guidance counsellors and the senior leadership team will meet regularly and are available to help and support any student who may be experiencing difficulties or feeling overwhelmed during this time. Our year heads are hosting remote assemblies with their year groups this week to meet with students and support them in preparing for remote learning and our guidance counsellor will provide practical tips to maintaining a positive learning routine during this school closure. We know that for students in third year and sixth year, this time is particularly stressful as we do not yet know what will happen with regard to the mock examinations and other aspects of the state examinations. Our approach to the mock exams is being worked on at the moment and further information on this is available in our guidance document. As a school, we value the holistic development of each student and the well-being of our entire school community. And so we strongly encourage you to take proactive steps to manage your physical, mental, emotional and spiritual health at this time. We encourage you to develop good habits and a good routine which begins with treating each day as if it were a normal school day. We encourage healthy sleeping and eating habits, regular breaks, exercise, good online and screen etiquette, as well as regular contacts with friends and family in line with public health guidelines at this time. These steps will help you to engage better with the remote learning environment and to ensure that when school reopens, you have kept pace with learning and assignments which have been put in place for you. All of this will leave you in a good place to meet the next stage of your learning journey in a healthy, happy and positive place. On behalf of us all in Colossi Ciaran, I want to wish you the very best in your learning journey and to assure you of our support in that journey. I look forward to welcoming you back when it's safe to do so and when conditions allow. But right now, stay safe, stay healthy and let's support each other through this time.